Hello, welcome to Barefoot in America. We are filming today from California. We're at Merino Beach in um, California, not too far from LA and not too far from San Diego. And right behind me is Paris Lake. So we're gonna do an active vinyasa to start today. So I'm gonna invite you to have a yoga block at the top of your mat. We're gonna start in standing. So just take a moment to come to the top of your mat. Inhale your arms up and overhead. Reach to the sky. Get nice and long. Pull the belly in. And exhale, hands to heart center. Take a moment to press palm to palm. Press your thumbs to your sternum. Lift your sternum to your thumbs. Bow your head. Take a moment to set an intention for today's practice. Release the arms on an exhale, lower them to your side. Shine your palms forward, reach fingertips to the earth. Take a moment to feel your feet root to the earth, toes pointing straight ahead, legs strong, low belly pulls in ever so subtly, lower rib cage nets down, upper rib cage lifts, shoulders point right to left, chin tucks, crown of head lifts, you're tall in your mountain posture. Think of your arms rising at a slight angle so you can see your thumbs and your peripheral vision as you inhale the arms up and overhead at the very top engage your belly give yourself a little back bend exhale hinge from your hips a flat strong back bending from your hip joints until your hamstrings say you must fold round in a forward fold bring your hands to shins or thighs press hands to legs straighten elbows flatten back Exhale, refold to rise up, soften hips and knees, lift your head and your heart, float the arms up, thumbs in the peripheral vision again, a little back bend at the top. Exhale, hands to heart center. There's a half sun salute. Inhale your arms down and out, float them overhead, thumbs in the periphery, all the way up, a little back bend at the top. Exhale, hinge from your hips, dive forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Giant step your right foot back. High lunge. Sink into the left knee as you reach back with your right leg. Set the right knee down. Float the arms up. Top of the right foot presses to the mat, sinking into your left knee. Pull in your belly, lift your heart. We're going to take three cactus breaths here for our arm. Exhale the arms to cactus. Lower them down. Inhale them up in front of you. Exhale the cactus. Lower them down. Inhale them up in front of you. One more time. Exhale the cactus. Lower them down. Inhale them up in front of you. Exhale the hands down to frame the left foot. Right foot tucks and steps forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold, soften hips and knees, reverse swan dive all the way up. Connect palm to palm at the top. Give it a little squeeze, right back into a forward fold, hinging from your hips. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold, giant step the left foot back, high lunge. Sink into your right knee as you press into your left heel. Lowering the left knee, untucking the foot, float the arms up. Sink into your right knee as you ground the top of the left shin and foot into the mat. Pull the belly in, lift your heart. Three more of those cactus breaths. Exhale the cactus. Inhale the arms down and up in front of you. Exhale the cactus. Lower the arms. Inhale them up in front of you. Exhale to cactus. Lower the arms. Inhale them up in front of you. Exhale the hands down to frame the right foot. Tuck the left toes, step the left foot forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Reverse swan dive all the way up. Palms connect at the top, give it a little squeeze. Exhale, right back into the forward fold. 
Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Giant step, right foot back, high lunge. Your choice, stay high or lower the knee. Float the arms up. Breathe nice and deeply, squaring your pelvis to the top of the mat. Pull the low belly in. Sink into the left knee. Three more cactus breaths. Exhale the cactus. Lower them down. Inhale, float them up. Exhale the cactus. Lower the arms. Inhale, float them up. One more time. Exhale the cactus. Lower them down. Inhale, float them up. Bring the hands down to frame the left foot. This time, step back to downward dog. Left foot steps back. Pause and downward dog. And from here, rest in child or down dog or flow to plank. Chaturanga from toes or knees. Inhale to cobra. Everyone meet in downward dog. And from downward dog, you can walk, giant step, or hop your feet forward to meet your hands. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Reverse swan dive all the way up. Palms squeeze together at the top. Exhale, right back into your forward fold. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Giant step, left foot back, high lunge. Sink into the right knee and again your choice. Stay high or lower the left knee as we did before. Inhale, float the arms up. Sink into your right knee. Pull in your low belly, pelvis squared at the top of the mat. Exhale the cactus. Lower the arms, inhale, float them up. Exhale the cactus. Lower your arms, inhale, float them up. Exhale the cactus. Lower your arms, inhale, float them up. Bring the hands down to frame the right foot. Step the right foot back. Downward dog. Your choice, rest in down dog. Child or flow to plank. Chaturanga. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, down dog. And your choice, walk, giant step, or hop your feet forward to meet your hands. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Reverse swan dive all the way up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Take a deep breath in your mountain posture. Inhale your arms to the side. Shine your palms forward. Float the arms up, thumbs in the peripheral vision. Touch the hands at the top. Exhale, hinge from your hips. Swan dive forward. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, full giant step, right foot back, high lunge. Place your block on the inside of your left foot, hand on the block. And remember your block has three heights. You can stay high or you can lower your knee. We're gonna add a twist. So from here, start to rotate your torso to the left, gazing out over your left shoulder left arm lifts to the sky. Really ground your left big toe knuckle because the knee may want to flare out. Create as much length in your spine and leg as you can. Stay for another breath. Exhale the left hand down. Scooch the block away. Step back to downward dog. Rest in down dog or child's or flow to plank. Chaturanga. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, down dog. From downward dog, walk, giant step or hop your feet forward to meet your hands. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold. Reverse swan dive, come all the way up, hands touch at the top. Exhale, hands to your heart center. Take a pause in mountain. Inhale your arms down and out and float them overhead. Exhale, hinge from your hips, dive forward. 
Inhale, flat back. Exhale, full giant step, left foot back. High lunge. Sink into the right knee as you press into the left heel. Your choice to stay high or lower the left knee. Block on the inside of the left foot. Left hand on the block. Start to rotate your torso. Right arm lifts to the sky. Gazing either ahead or up at the right hand. Creating as much length in your spine and leg as you can. And really ground the right big toe knuckle. Stay for another breath. Inhale. Exhale, right hand down to the mat. Stepping back to down dog. Pause and dog. Or child's or one last flow to plank. Chaturanga down. Cobra. Exhale, downward dog. Pause and dog for just a couple breaths. Lower to your knees. Make them as wide as the mat. Big toe knuckles touch. Sit back to child's pose. Inhale, back to all fours, center of the knees, right under your hips. Inhale to a cow posture, lifting head and tailbone. Tuck your toes under you. Exhale to cat, arch the back up, drop the head, look at your navel. Inhale to cow. Exhale to cat. Inhale to cow. Exhale to cat, adding a ruddy goose. Sit back to child. Lower your elbows to the mat. Scoop your chest through. Coming up to cow, to cat, to child. Drop the elbows. Inhale, scooping through to cow, to cat, to child. Just a couple more rounds. Really mobilizing your spine. Linking movement with breath for vinyasa flow. Last time, pause and child. Inhale up to all fours. Really feel your hands root to the mat, pull you to all fours. Tuck your toes, push down and forward in the hands, hips lift up and back, downward dog. From downward dog, control the descent of the knees down. See if you can let them just hover from the mat for a moment. Set them down, sit back to child. Inhale, back up to all fours, tuck your toes, press your hands down and forward, lift to downward dog. And then lower the knees down just to the place where they hover off the mat. Hold, lower them down, sit back to child. One more sequence just like this. Come up to all fours, tuck your toes, press up to downward dog. And then from there, lower the knees down just to the place where they hover off the mat. And set them down, sit back to child. Inhale to all fours, tuck your toes, find downward dog again. Pause there for a moment. And now inhale forward to plank. Shoulders come over the hands, maybe out in front of them just a bit. Two strong legs, set the knees down. Exhale back to child. Inhale back to all fours, tuck your toes. Press into plank, straighten the legs. And now lift your hips, downward dog. Inhale to plank. Lower the knees down, exhale to child. Inhale to plank. Exhale back, downward dog. Inhale to plank. 
lower the knees down to child. Last one. Inhale to plank. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale to plank. Lower the knees. Pause in child. Wrap your arms around behind your back if you like. Forehead on the mat, just resting in a restorative child. Shift your weight to either hip, swing your legs around to seated. Bring your feet to the top of your mat and lie down on your back. And from lying on your back, inhale your arms up and overhead. Press your feet away, toes to the sky, knees to the sky. Root the left heel to the earth. Hold it firmly there as you exhale, give your right leg a hug. Knee to chest. Inhale the arms right back overhead. Straighten the right leg. Root the heel. Exhale. Give your left leg a hug. Inhale the arms overhead. Straighten the left leg. Exhale. Give your right leg a hug. Inhale the arms overhead. Lower right leg. Exhale. Give left leg a hug. One more of those each side. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, hug the right leg. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, hug the left leg. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, hug both legs. Knees to chest. Pause there for a moment. And then using a strap, our hands on the back of the thighs, just send both legs to the sky. Feel the L shape of your body. Press the heels up, expand the toes, press the sacrum down, tuck the chin, shoulders press down, holding it for another five, four, three, two, one. Give your knees a hug. Pause there for a breath. And lower the legs down. Straighten them one at a time. Taking the time for Savasana today. Let your arms drift from your body. Palms up. Legs drift apart. Toes fall out. Simply feel yourself lying on the mat. Take a moment to scan your body. Relaxing each part. Starting with your jaw, tongue, mouth. Relax your cheeks. Feel your eyes resting in their sockets. Relaxing your eyebrows, forehead, scalp, back of head resting on the mat. Suppleness through your whole neck. Heart open, shoulder blades resting. Relaxing both arms from the shoulders, the right and left upper arm, elbow, forearm, wrist, hand, all ten fingers completely letting go. Relaxing the front of your body, the back of your body from your chest, your rib cage, your belly, upper back, mid back, low back, the entire pelvic girdle relaxing and letting go. Feel softness through both hips, thighs, knees, shins, calves, ankles, feet, all ten toes. Let it be, let it go. And take as much time as you have today here in Savasana. I thank you for joining me in the active flow of vinyasa. Vinyasa. And I encourage you to take this pause in Savasana for a few more lingering minutes if you have them. Namaste.